welcome to my YouTube channel, New and Returning Viewers. In today's video, I will be doing a tutorial of dressing up this handsome man in his trapping gear. So there are a few different pieces that I'll show you that I use. that I do use is a, a nylon surcingle that goes just behind his withers that is just at the end of his mane and behind him is what we tell, call a toe crew. Okay. When I go to put the tail croup on in the sir single, is I first place the sir single just on his hind end, give it a little rub. Okay, perfect. Good boy. What I, what I do next is lift his tail, okay, row it just a little bit so that he knows I'm there. Good boy. Put the tail through. Easy boy. The tail through it. Again, when he does a little bit of moving around, if he's not too sure, just give him a little bit of a crack and rub. I then also do this for Snowball. She does a lot more dancing around. It's done. I slowly move the tail through up. This is a very thick tail. You just want to rest it below the dock of the tail. Good boy. All the hair goes through. And I slide the surgeon belt up to wrap where it's going to be placed. And that is the first place. And then I will take you over around the side. So, because I, I share it between all three of them, usually what I do is I then take the girth, put it to the very first hole. It's sent nicely, and then I'm gonna leave it the video camera here. But I will go around the other side and then do it up as well. That one I usually do the second or third hole and stuff. And I'll come back to the side. I'll go up to the fourth hole. Oh, what? See, it's still very loose, but because I only put it on this side or third hole on the other side. I'll do it at least another one or two. Just don't want it moving too much or sliding so that it goes underneath them. Good boy. There's a couple of moves to see if it's nice and tight, but not pitching. Mm 
You're okay. You're okay. I put on as is a chest plate. Okay, you don't want to do it too, too tight. You just put on the fourth hole. And on both sides you have this, which I place on the bottom hole. Camera ring. Nicely sit. Then take his lead rope, I don't do it first on this side, but on the other side, I do clip this on it. So I'll do that on the other side, and then I'll come back around. Sometimes it does take a couple of tries. tie it a couple of times, two two loops. Good boy. Good boy. And for training purposes, I use a, a long line and I will go on both sides. I will usually hook it up to help her. Just to make sure it's nice and tight. And then I will go through the top side ring and just feed it through. And then on the 
other side of the brown one and do the same thing. It does hook up to his bridle. I will then unhook it from his halter. Back up to his surcingle. And then the very last piece. that I will then put on at the very end is this bridle, but because I'm not actually working with them today, I will not be putting it on. But once it's on, I'm going to unclip the lens lines from my stir single, I will attach it to the ding ring bit. Do it on both sides, and then off we go. So I do hope you guys all enjoyed the tutorial and everything. It's a very nice little boy, standing pretty nice and still. Um, the only one who we don't do any of this on is Princess, because she doesn't really like anything on her side. We have tried it a couple times, but has right, and she's a little spooky with it, so we do a lot more showmanship with her. I also do showmanship with Mr. Major and Snowball. Do some of that this summer. And I'm hoping in a couple weeks that I can actually have a video of me lunging him and all his gear. And in the winter, as you would have seen if you saw my introduction of Snowball or them playing in the snow, we do do it with a sled behind both him and uh, Snowball. We have the other one that's tied it to the string of the sled. And then we'll tie it to his lead line or her lead line. And we're hoping maybe not this summer, but next summer to buy a cart and uh, work with them on that. Good boy. So I do hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section down below. Or what you thought of it. If you are new and haven't done so but would like to see more, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. And I will see you guys all next week. Bye!